before they came on board in Lagos State. Community Development Associations and Community Development Committees are now engaging themselves in the process aimed at improving the social, economic and environmental situation of their localities. They are taking actions and participating together for their communities to become more vital, not just economically, but a strong functioning community itself. Welcome to today's edition of Lagos Community Updates. I am Adijoke Shodendi Adinyoju. Join me as we see communities taking initiatives by themselves. For members of the Unity Community Development Association in Shomolu local government area, the progress of the community is not negotiable. But the passion for development encountered a challenge recently. This road had become impassable for many months. The community decided to fix it and bring it back to use. A new culvert had to be built. The covered here before, it was old. The thing had been spoiled in the middle, in the sense that no way for even a bike to even pass by. So it was then we decided to do it. There was a culvert, but it had been old and spoiled. No any traces of culvert on it anymore. Determined to take the freight in the run hands, the CDA went house by house seeking donations. This culvert is the result of the noble efforts. The community's self-help project has brought respite to over a thousand people that assess the road every day. This one was done last year. Follow ni Olaiwola is the chairman of Unity CDA. He revealed that the Itato terrible condition of the walkway jet community members into action. Our community, form of four streets, Ayepe, Akane, Duru, and the Ogobadi Dog. We started from this tunnel erosion. It was when we did this uh, erosion, we decided to look onto this culvert, just because there was a time government enacted a law that Okada should not pass the main road. All those Okada, they are, they are finding ways to get to the other street. And this place is porous, it's open. So no way for them to cross over to Balogo. And this Balogo link, we not decided to do it. Since it had been done, people around the air, they really appreciated our efforts. Both Okada people and the people selling here, people residing in this area, they, they appreciated our effort. This, this will link to Palogun and if we will say Alade Market. And we can take through this place down to Onepan Junction. What could have been a death trap now serves both Unity CDA and other surrounding communities. Although the culvert is functioning, a few of the contributors towards its construction are of blessed memory. This project has also boosted commercial activities in the area. Besides the culvert, the CDA also raised funds to build the drains and check the flood water from running their homes. The repair of the nearly collapsed drainage system through collective community efforts is another achievement of the CDA. This part of the road was... Mrs. Esther is a notable community development campaigner. She contributed to the rehabilitation of the drain. She told Lagos Community Updates that she donated because the road was becoming impassable for both motorists and pedestrians alike in the area. To keep invaders away, 
the proactive community leaders also put acts together and built a gate, making it possible for the community to sleep with their eyes closed. Indeed, a silent competition for self-help seems to be going on amongst CDAs in Shomolu local government area. A few streets away is Okesuno. Okesuno CDA was also doing the amazing things. This unique community comprises residents of one street, yet the energy for community work is exemplary. Okesuno did not just fix its transformer base. We were told by the community head Dakbo Odudua how the One Street CDA contributed over 600,000 naira to build necessary infrastructures to make life better for the inhabitants. When we had electricity problems, we contributed to do the base where the transformer is being mounted. We had to cover up all looks, loopholes that mysterians used to use in coming into our community. We had to, we did gates and we helped indigenous students. In Okesuno CDA, community members are also securing the future by empowering the youths with skills and knowledge. One of the beneficiaries praised the initiative. This community has a lot of students in, um, in different forms, in, especially in academic. So this community, they did um, a training program for all students and they did competition and I, I was part of the lucky people that won the competition and they bought GCE form for us. They, they taught us different kind of handwork. They taught us how to sew, how to uh, on um, soap making, um, how to do makeup and different kind of things. Those, those of us that our parents are not, they are, they are not actually buoyant. They helped us, like they give food at times and they clothe some of us. These two communities of Shomolu local government area have shown that it is possible to do more to bring developments to their areas if they have more supports. They want government, corporate organizations and individuals to join hands in their mission to rebuild their communities.